And that's my opinion. Yeah, I mean, the double tier is just like, it's the least of their worries, man. The game's already over by that point. It's just like, please, please. Yeah, dude, that, was have, that was hoping for a miracle. That's turns what have that five fucking thousand HP, bro. The turrets have yeah. five fucking thousand HP. How are you losing your turret at like eight minutes? These turrets are indestructible, bro. How do you how do you lose that turret so early, man? Pick something to keep the turret alive. That's all I'm saying. Yep. Feel that. Oh shit. We loading it. There we go. All right, let's get it, guys. This is game three. Game three. They're going to of semifinals. Okay. Tyler the Camille ban. The Camille ban is out, dude. The Camille ban is you out. By lol tyler one dot com there it is discount, discount code, code alpha. Alpha. alpha guys hearts in chat for tyler one guys fifty thousand dollars fifty g's you understand think about that what streamer does that every streamer they use sponsors and other companies he's using, he's using his own fifty thousand dollars yeah make sure to go over to lol tyler one dot com hearts in chat for him and listen if you have it this is the stream to use it on twitch prime this is the stream guys hearts in chat for him shout out to joe as well voice of an yeah. angel and winner of this game, man, they go to semifinals. This is it. This, this is it, boys. You're gonna get it. And Lucian's through, dude. Finally, oh, wow. same. But they were banning it every single game, aren't they? Like, wait, every single game they were banning it. But that. do you really want to give Lucian to a player that ints every yeah, single early? Yeah, wait a minute, what the fuck? But yeah, why would they? We just went over the whole, the ball thing was slacking, and now they're gonna give him an aggressive ass. What the hell? Okay, well, I mean, I, I hope that they, I hope they at least commit, dude. If you're gonna go out, go out in a blaze of glory, playing aggressive Hell support yes. and Lucian, run it the fuck down bot lane. I want to see ten kills or ten deaths. Fuck yeah, man. Yo, wait, amazing, they take, wait, they take Lucian but ban Brom. That's interesting. Yep. Hmm. Okay. Well, okay. Dude, if I if I see if I see Lucian Nami or Lucian Jana, Lucian Jana, I might disconnect from the call, dude. I I I don't know. I don't know if I can handle it. Oh, that. the Urgot memes and puns are coming from your boy here. We got oh, Urgot God, on the man. left side here. Now, let me tell you one thing here. I'm looking at these drafts, and I feel like, I mean, you know, if you watch like a like a pro tourney, a pro circuit, the next day, all the players that are not pro, they choose these comps. They can't play. And this is, I'm seeing this a lot here. People are just choosing things because they think pro players play it, so it's good. You need to play what you're good at. Play the comps you're comfortable at. And don't over, it's just, it's it's something I see all the time. Very disgusting. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I mean, I, I think here for Fake God, this Urgot pick, this is exactly what he played in scouting grounds. He got, you know, a lot of hype after that tournament. People thought he was the best player out of all 20 that went to scouting grounds. And it was mainly off the back of this. Like, he played a beast, Urgot, carried games. He's super tanky, front line, did it all. And now with the Camille band, I think that this is his game, dude. This is his game to show that he has it when it really matters. NA Scouting Grounds, what the fuck is that shit, dude? We're at the TCS right now, dude. Game three, advancing to semifinals. If you win this game, you got to show up here. That's right. This is it. This is where you show up. This is what you do. Fifty thousand dollars on the line. You have to play your best here. There's nothing left to do. We have a year guy on the team, and I think it's 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 gonna do well. I don't know why the Zinzal got banned. He didn't play it very well, but I guess it's a BM pick. No, it's a comfort pick for him. You know what I mean? So I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. It make, that makes sense. Fuck it. Yeah. What 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 if Tarzan pulls out the graves, dude? Are we gonna see Tarzan I graves? I hope he does. Oh. I have faith in Tarzan. I'm go I'm rooting for Tarzan here. I, I really hope something comes out of this. Yeah, yeah, me too, man. That's my boy right there. Yeah. <sighs> Let's see what we get picked here. Yeah, I'm curious what they're going to go with here. I really want to see what Lucian's going to go with bot lane if they're going to do that pussy shit or if they're going to actually man up and like take a fucking... Like, they're against Alistair too, so they can't... Like, you can't pick like Nami into that. It's going to end so Ooh, bad. Ooh, the Nocturne. Ooh, the Nocturne. I, 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 I just, I don't know. I, I smell it, dude. I smell that whiff. I smell the fear coming from blue team. I feel like they're just going to go the, the Nami. There somewhere. it is. There's the graves. The Tarzan graves. You it's call here. He wants to put them in their grave. Hey, <laughs> high two. That's what's up, dude. That's it. Dude, it's a change of pace bot, finally. They're either going to go 20-0 or 0-20 now. This is it. There's no middle yep. ground for that shit. Dude, he's what gonna put the—he's. He, I bet you he hovers Pike, picks Nami. Oh my God! Don't do it. I was. <laughs> dude, he fucking that shit. Oh my God! Cute. Wait, no what workout. is this? Is, is, is this singed? This is Pike. Please New champion. Just lock it. Just lock it. What the hell? No, is they're pike? gonna play. Hey, there we go, man. There we Wait, fucking go. What? What, what is, is a pike? pike? Pike is an assassin support, and a full lethality building assassin support. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. You heard me right. It, it literally is built off doing damage. Ooh. 
we have the Gnar coming out. This huh. is an amazing pickup here. We have a tanky Gnar here. He turns into a big giant. If you guys don't know when he gets mad, kind of like Tyler1 himself, lolTyler1.com, discount code alpha. Hit the Twitch primes if you do have them. Pike, I mean, I don't know if he's an assassin. He looks more like a you know a necromancer or something, but hey, I'll take uh, it. He's, 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 this champion can pop off or will intentionally feed. And I mean, yeah, judging by how, how it's gone, it's, it's almost 100% intentionally feeding, but I, I respect it, dude, because it's a pick that he has to go in and because he has to go in, we're gonna we're gonna see the zero ten this game, dude. I I think so. Believe, I'm calling bot lane zero zero ten, maybe zero maybe zero fifteen. You really think they're gonna feed that hard, man? Like actually, look. I don't know, but I hope they do for the for the comedic sense. Because I mean, I, if, if we're not gonna get good play, at least we can get comedy. You know? Okay. Yeah, that's all I can ask for, man. I don't know. It's like I'm just like seeing so much pick from red side too, like Varus ulti, Nocturne ulti. Like it's with Alice, it's gonna be a fucking just pain in the ass for blue, dude. I don't know. Game. No, no, pa no, pa you, 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 you gotta pause somewhere. You gotta, okay, 20. We'll, we'll stop at 20. We'll stop at 20. Okay, yeah, stop at 23. Stop at 23. Stop at 23. Top, stop at 23, guys. Yep. Okay. I'm at 23. I'm at 23. Yes. Perfect. Let's go. 25, 20, 26, 26, 27, 27 28. 28. Yep. Uh, there we go. Perfect. All right, we're good. <laughs> uh, let's get it. Oh, look at this invade coming in from blue team. Oh, all going top side. Nar, they can maybe force Nar to take E. Nar's hey, AFK hey, now. He's checking his yeah, corner. Yeah, they him for hops. That's good. Yeah, that's that's really bad for his lane, man. With with E starting. Are we on the same time? 47, 48, 48 49, yes, 49. Yes. Okay, cool. I just want to double check before we get in. I didn't want to start motor mouth. We're completely shit. good. That was a big hurdle yeah. jump from Nar. There's a ward no, right here. That's good. Forcing him to start that is is, is going to help out Urgot a little bit. Mm -hmm. Urgot's looking like Jabba the Hutt here. This is a great skin. Yeah, he, he a little thick. He a little thick. Minions has spawned. Couple C's in there. Jurassic with the BM. His team name's GG's. Is yeah, Alistair I mean, if you if, if you saw GG's play uh, last season, you wouldn't think it's BM. That's all I'm saying. Oh. I hey. to sit on that ward. Is, I, I don't know. Are they just watching, or is Alistair Varys looking for a fight level one? I feel like they uh, lose hard they're... against Lucian Pike, but... Okay, they're it, not gonna it depends if, if the pike face checks they're probably okay yeah but... all right let's get it on the way guys this is it here oh the graves reloading his gun two bullets one says come here one says death he's gonna do the golem clear here make sure that he gets ahead nocturne nice. smited his red huh so he's not gonna have smite for the bottom scuttle yeah that's gonna basically give it for free to graves too following already pushing in really hard too against Pike. No, he, he can actually get the scuttle if he goes straight to it and Graves is clearing golems. No, that's so. why they push so hard bot. They tried to set up for it. You know what I mean? They're actually, yeah. like, you can see the comms are really good for red team right now. Like they, they they knew exactly what they were going for when they shoved in Pike. Yep. Trade coming in from Urgot top. It's looking good right now. I think Nar's a great matchup against Urgot. Is it Urgot or Urgot? It's Urgot. <laughs> okay, you Urgot. Say, you can say Urgot though. I thought I was right. Nah. Ooh, Pike. They got the level two spike Ooh. coming up from blue side ball lane. Take That's really big. Though. Nice pull. They're, they're really loving this Varus pick. Yeah, man. Okay, got the double auto off. Proc the press attack. Decent Very poke. Good. This matchup mid, this is not an inherently good matchup for Lissandra, though. So it's really, really? going to be up to him to try to just bitch it out the best Ooh. he can. Good dog. This Varus actually the looks. This, Var this Varus skin's looking like that uh, one hero, uh, Cassandra. It starts with a cake. Uh, uh, Callista or some shit. Wait, let's see. Oh, Ballista, Ballista, Callista, Callista, Callista. The Callista, Varus yeah. skin. You're bit. seeing shit, man. Ooh. Oh, the invade coming in from Tarzan. He knows that he beats oh, this guy. Oh, they're going early for game. it. Alistair's right there. He could go for a big knockup. Oh, they, 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 they caught the Cassio. Cassio flash. Cassio they got a knockdown on the side. Burn down this fast, man. They can win this. Oh. They can win this. Titties milk. No. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Nice, nice All right. So summoners, what did they get? They got. They got the Cassiopeia flash for the heal from Lucian yeah. and the ignite from Pike. I don't know yeah, if that's they, good, man. That, uh, it's really gonna be, see. It's, it's gonna be up to Tarzan to punish that flash. Yeah, for sure. Nars but overall. Weak here. Overall, this is good for for Graves, man. I they're looking to dive. That. They're looking yeah, to dive top. He got off right the blimp. Yeah, Nar's so low too, man. He's got flash up, but I don't think it means shit right now. He's gonna have to if, leave this wave. If, if he does not leave this wave, right he's now. dead. Oh, if he does not leave the wave, he is dead. 
Oh, he yep. Yeah, he got no greedy. Way. Once yeah, again, NA greed. NA greed. greed. Even need help? Like, what the oh, hell? the juke! No, he's running into first blood by your got. He got. I got. Who got? We got. He got. Got! Nice job, Bali. Wait, now call. They went call on Lucian, so it looks like. Just like we were talking about before. So he picked Lucian, so and now they're gonna just try and farm out bot with the pike? Huh. Yeah, Lucian pike uh, farm lane, boys. Huh, that's interesting. I agree. Very interesting. Oh, cool, Cast, wait. Cast didn't rush tier either. Hmm. Yeah, he didn't have money for it, so he's he's yeah. building towards the tier, but yeah. what he based at an extremely weird time. He wasted all of his mana in that first fight, burned his flash, he had to base, so. Just did not have the money for tier, which really sucks. I mean, when you play yeah, that's mid lane Cassian, up. Yeah, for sure. First you strike you need a Drake too. Mm, I don't think that's a two hard, I don't think. But yeah. We called out the Drakes, and now they've changed the cloud. We yeah, found they a... Uh... Yep. It's to unscript it real quick. <laughs> Crab spawning top. That's going to go over to Tarzan almost 100%. Oh, yeah, There's no way, no way they can... No way they can That's a huge hit from Urgot. Urgot, and that's great damage, Brian. Wow. That yep. champion is just relentless, man. Yeah, look, look Nocturne's coming up there, though, trying to contest oh, yeah. it. But Graves no is there, worries. too. Graves is there, too. Should be okay. Nocturne coming up. Nocturne says, never mind, I'm going back to the store. Yep. Tarzan got the crab. He's going to recall, pick up his red spine, and then go back to his golems, man. This Lucian he's is he's really up carrying this lane. 400 gold on Nocturne. 400 gold already, man. That's fucking clean. Yeah, that's just the, the pathing, man. He got, yeah, he's doing a good he got job. the crab. He got the enemy blue. He's doing well. Oh, oh my. Alistar gained some good Ooh, TP there. Lucian's huge so stun by Alistar. Oh, it's, what's going to happen here? Nope. No, something's burned yet, though. They really want this, though. Pike's going in invisible. Out. Shoving out mid together because Cassio needs to back for that tier. This is huge. This is a huge game three. This is the slow pace they want to play it at. Fake God sitting up here with Urgot. He knows what's going on. He knows what he wants. This is looking good for blue team so far. Mm. Lucian bottom lane is really caring. Once again, man, the fucking bot side just getting shoved in and giving gold, dude. This happens. This happened every single game so far. Well, I mean, Pike's just swimming around like he's a Dementor from you know Harry Potter. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> yeah, Tarzan's gonna be six after red. Maybe once he's six, they can look for something bot. They have a pink ward and tri bush. Yeah, Definitely a possible situation. Ooh, good oh, good pull on Harris, but like, what do you what do you do with it, man? Apparently, you uh, farming, dude. Fuck. You just walk away. Yeah. Damn. They know where the ward is. Tarzan's looking through lane. This is the play oh, they're setting. Might up. be able to get something down here. This is this all. It, that this is the first time I've actually seen him starting to prioritize bot lane here. If he gets them rolling, maybe they can. Maybe they just need a snowball. You know what I mean? They can and help. This this is the mind game, dude. Blue team, their bot lane sucks so bad, you don't know if they're actually baiting <laughs> or if they're setting up or, or, or if they're just, just, just going. God yeah. damn. It's actually 400 IQ. This could have been the strategy all along. Reverse okay. psychology. Let's just force it back off, man. They didn't have any vision. They just kind of felt that shit out. Good job. Bot side. Oh, no, they don't. They're going for it. They go That's for the a sun. huge pick. Graves going in. Oh. That's a huge flash in. Graves going in. It's Tarzan. Tarzan is going in. Oh my god. Tarzan gets the first kill. He's going for a double. It's a double kill. Tarzan is swinging on the vines. Yelling. Oh. That's it. <laughs> huge fucking play, man. Oh, wow. 1.5k gold lead now, man. Double wow. Double bot. That's this is the Tarzan insane. Graves, baby. Yep. This is it. That's what we want, baby. fucking stacked up. Oh, they're looking so good, dude. So and he gets here. bot crab here. Is wow. he gonna contest the enemy blue as well? Looks like he's not gonna be greed. He's taking everything, dude. Not what Nocturne's trying to go top and kind of like make up for this. He's double six. He could go for an ult here, but it looks Urgot smart enough to just play back too. Ur yeah. Nocturne's not gonna get shit for this. This is a, this is so good for blue team. This is uh, uh, this dude. Tarzan needs to be on his game. He's the leader of the team. He's the MVP, the VIP. He needs to lead them. He needs to take their hands and say, "Come with me to the motherland." This is what he's doing in this game. I'm very proud. Oh no, he is, dude. He is literally got. He's he is definitely baby stepping them right to the fucking. He victory really right is, now, man. He really is, I, dude. And as somebody that plays solo queue, you never want to see Tarzan pick up two kills early on Graves, man. He has the potential yeah. to carry this game. This could be season six. Oh shit. 
You know, CS across the board is like almost dead even too, except for Graves right now. Everyone's like dead even. All the lanes are breaking dead even, but Graves has just got so much more gold than Nocturne. And they're dude. setting up the Little dive top. Up. They're setting up the dive top. Yep. They can dive him for full HP. Tarzan has 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 no ult, but they do have Urgot ult and Ignite. And the mini Nars is not going to be stacked up. They're going for it. They're going for yes, it. Here it comes. Are. This oh, is it. nice. Graves coming in. Oh, good. Graves. Oh, he's got the Ooh. jump. It's given. Oh. Urgot's going to switch. Oh, it's Urgot's he's Graves he's wants this kill. He wants it like I want Twitch Prime subs in the chat. He gets it. <laughs> Thank God Let's Urgot go. with the kill. He got. Me got. You got. I got. That is huge, baby. That is huge. Honestly, huge fucking play, yeah. dude. And, and who gives a fuck about the Cloud Drake, dude? Yeah, it's more literally getting yeah, cast. Seriously, that's exactly it. They're going to lose that. Who gets, that doesn't mean shit, dude. They're going to take so much gold off that top tower right now. They're ca they're cashing in. They can might even take the whole thing. That is huge. That is That huge. is so much fucking gold. That is so that much is. gold for blue team, man. That is. Are they going to get the first turn? Are they just going to stay up here for it? Looks like no. Looks like they're just going to peace. I agree. Urgot is just carrying. I'm telling you, this, this Urgot champion, I thought his ult was to reverse and flip, but apparently he got changed because I, like, I didn't yeah, see like that happen. <laughs> oh, that was four years ago. Oh, well, uh, what does his ult do now? It's uh, it's an execute. You oh. pretty much, you hit it on somebody, if they drop below a certain HP, you instantly kill them. That's how that shit works. It's busted. Oh, so it's like a uh, axe from Dota 2 or Execute from World of Warcraft. Yeah, something like that. Oh, Nocturne oh, waiting for him bot lane, though. See, Punch I'm telling you, man. Invent God, all the different God, ways to feed. Damage. He's Jurassic. inventing all different ways. The Ian. Who would have expected that? I've never seen that before. Good shit. <laughs> he's playing a great character, Pike. I mean, Graves is on his way bot lane right now, but they're going to be able to cash in the meantime. Lucian can't. I mean, he's got, he's got to clear the wave right now. He's still got... He's got no calling, yeah, no one summons, more plate, no That's it. Yeah, they're going to have to walk away from that shit. What's the next dragon up? It's going to be what? Mountain? Mm. Is eh. it a mountain dragon? Huh. This bubble on no Urgot's first tower goes there. Yeah. Yep. Oh, Urgot's at a position where he can now harass the the Nar properly and starve the Nar from farm. That's Urgot's playing amazing right now. Yeah, this is gonna be rough because the Urgot has pressure top. He's gonna be more useful in team fights for the foreseeable future. Oh fuck yeah! And that turret is almost dead. So if Tarzan just pass up there, they can probably just force that down. Just there's no way on that. Hell yeah! There's no way that Nocturne and Nar can hold that. Yeah, they'll get killed instantly. Yes. Black Cleaver to a Ruby Crystal and a Longsword top lane. <sighs> yeah, and they're looking for the turret right now. Yeah, they're rotating up. Yeah, you got Liz, you got Pike coming. Nocturne's going back and he has ult up. Doesn't he's just he's gonna get bubbled. Star is playing again, very dude. greedy. Very greedy. Liz oh, comes yeah. up. Flash he's gonna engage here. Flash he got ult. He should ult. Don't get greedy. There's the ult by Liz. Urgot goes in. And there's the Pike. More like Psych. Yeah. You're dead. 3 0 wow. Urgot top, dude. God, dude. Just, that is just so hard to deal with, man. And, and I just want to see I want to see all these guys back up. Just give give him full turret gold. You all suck. God damn it. Yeah, for real. It's cash. Yeah, well, hey, Alice Traveris are pushing bot lane down. At least they're going to get some trade of gold here. They're not, it's yep. not first blood tower, but at least it's something. Yep. It does. Like, it keeps it kind of even. That is amazing. They get it. What the fuck are they going to get it? Oh. God, Urgot's playing phenomenal. Is so tanky, man. It takes like six years. And six fucking kids in time to get that. Wait, so wait, five to one. Cloud it's dragon on the, the top side. side. Eh. Like, I don't know, man. 2k gold lead, it's good. It looks really good because it's on, like, Urgot and stuff. Is there hope for Red to come back? I mean, there's always hope when you got a, a bot lane like this. So, mm. I think that they can come back, but it's it's going to be tough, man. The Urgot and the Graves are going to be yep. strong for the foreseeable future. It's really going to depend on if they get one of those picks, if they get the 600 gold shut down on either the Graves or the Urgot. If they're able to get that, recollect themselves, they might have a chance. The biggest problem I see right now is it goes back to my point earlier in the uh, in, in the pregame. Teams that are ahead like this, they, they need to learn how to capitalize, how to make the next objective move. They need to capitalize as much as possible with this lead and not allow red team any wiggle room oh, yeah. to come back from this game. <clears throat> the protobelt rush on this too. <laughs> how long has this pink ward been? In the blue side jungle the for or, game, for man. blue side, it, I've seen it so many times. They're just the walking over it, game. fucking dancing on top of it. Jesus Christ! I mean, red team's grouping up top side. Pikes, uh, Pikes there. They, I mean, they can go in. Graves Ooh. got red. This is, this is scary, man. This is oh, scary. Oh, with the ult. Oh. It's a defensive ult. 
Ugh. It was, it okay. Was ult. That's a waste. That's unfortunate. Yeah, you never want to see the defensive ult this early, yeah. though. Yeah, it's rough. I wouldn't know. It's like, well, how is Nar gonna stop Urgot now, too? There's just nothing he can. There's nothing he can do. Urgot's it's gotta be through Yeah, it's. Gotta it, be it's mid. Oh. I mean, Nocturne with no ulti here. They're just trying yeah, to. Just, they, no yeah, they have no Nocturne ulti. <clears throat> Uh, this is a shit. great, great. Oh, they're gonna engage this. They I wouldn't. Vision. They want it. They shouldn't. Winter knows. It may be December, but not nice for him. Job. Nice riff, dude. Good job, blue team. And they they gotta make sure they get this mountain drag as well. They should just run yeah. straight there, and that's what it looks like they are doing. No nocturnal still. They can win this fight. Yeah, they can push them off though. They got rifts coming mid. Then they can't. Yep. They can't give up mid for free. Oh, and the ghost coming in from Urgot. He oh, wants Urgot, to find yeah. blood. He, he, ults, he ults early. Oh, man, they're going hard. Wow. Listen to back. Nice CC. Three man. Great. Oh, 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 where's their ult? Liss overextends the cockiness. Pike takes down Alistar. Oh, Goddamn, dude. She did not press R. 2.5k up, man. Looking beautiful. At least they stopped the Rift Hill before it got to mid, which is nice. But now, what? They get a free Mountain Dragon? They're fucked. Oh. Pike on the cast up, there, nice up. dude. Nar in the back gets flipped up. Can't That's get a huge Nar. swap by Urgot. Nocturne flashes in. They win this. Oh, they win oh, this no. hard. Urgot really going in. Pike is just taking Go the win right here. Oh my Shut goodness, Lucian with the vanish oh, flash. His name is Vanish, and he vanished into their back line. Oh, dude. This game is looking Three like a sweep. Out. Yeah, man. 3K up. Free mountain. That's lit. That's, that's nine so, to four. So <laughs> the score might as well be nine one one. Wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That is amazing. Yeah, I mean, I, wasn't really taking the lead here. I don't think that that fight could have went much better for, for red team here. I mean, yeah. the Lissandra didn't even press R. She didn't press R in the entire team fight, and they still lost it. That bounty on Grave starting to look real fucking juicy, man. 700. Shit. Yeah. They did get it's, the Urgot bounty on the too, which is nice. The, the Cassio is starting to get strong, though. I mean, she she just picked up a huge yeah. bounty on the Urgot. She has her Seraphs completed. She almost is towards that Leandre's there. If they win this game, it's going to have to be on the back of the Cassio. Cassio is the For only sure. one that can actually kill Urgot yes, and Graves yes, here. Yes, yes. If she can burst correctly, then she can win this game. I think at this point, Nora needs to go full tank, not worry about damage, and go for the late game. He, he well, he's got to finish that cleaver, dude. He's, he has to. Like, he's Are they going to clear this pick? <clears throat> nope, they're still not clearing that pick board. Nope. <laughs> shit, Ur man. Look at Urgot here. He's just big. Next dragon's going to be Ocean, too. What, blue team's grouping up, trying to go mid lane? I mean, yeah. I mean... It's one to one on towers. They could group. I mean, they're way stronger for fights now. I mean, it, it would be pretty smart to try and force something now. Ur Urgot's got to be careful here. Cassio yeah. can kill him, can pick him off. He does have exhaust though. Wait, is it normal for him to go righteous glory, or do you think the team just wants more engaged? I didn't. Is that a normal build for someone like yeah, Urgot? Yeah, that, that's that's the most standard Urgot oh, okay. build right now. Okay. Righteous glory into uh, stone plate is what people normally go after Black Cleaver. That so. must be. A, that makes it even more of a pain in the ass too. Goddamn. And I definitely think he's going to go towards the Negatron Cloak here. Like, yeah. the only person that can kill him is the um, Ooh, Cassio. Cass, yep, and the Negatron Cloak will. There's no flash on this Nocturne. Ow. There's no flash on the Nocturne. Nice spell shield, though. That was good. Uh, Yo, they did a great pick they on Graves. Tarzan. Oh, that Urgot. Oh, no. Fuck, one for one traded. This Tough. is not looking good. They're coming back. This Varus is, is kept alive. Varus goes down by list. Varus gets the double kill. Urgot and Pike go down. We have uh, Alistar on the list. What's going to happen? Oh, Vanish no, comes in from the back. Lucian can't pull on the cutie pie. Run. No. No, I'm going to go down. Oh, that is a throw. That is a throw. Wait. Who is this guy? What just happened? I, what I never... just I'm I'm pretty sure that the Lucian disconnected from the game there. Yeah, that was pretty rough, dude. That was pretty rough. That and now they get really mid tower, bad. dude. Wow, I cannot believe it looks. We were just hyping up blue team so hard, how they can't lose, how they're just are so unbeatable. And then you called that the Cassiope helped shred down Urgot and shit, and they just fucking down. And they just got back so much gold. They got bounties. They evened up the gold lead. They got the mid tower. They took the objective lead. They're looking. They're looking so and if fucking you, good now. And if you look at the scoreboard, I got my karma, but reversed. 
Holy shit. Dude, you are the prophet. Dude, you have literally called it so fucking much. You have literally, <laughs> you're the prophet, dude. You keep I calling know. it, man. I know. It was good patience that fight from the Cassiopeia, holding yeah. on to the ult, but now she has a cleanse and a QSS, so Urgot's not going to be able to ult her anymore. There's going to be no way to really CC her. What do you do to deal with this Cassiopeia here, is the question. Espe yeah, the, the QSS, yeah, you're right. It's like, how it went, oh, I don't know, I have no idea. That's going to be so hard for them to deal with. I mean, oh, oh. fuck, I have no idea. They're going to have to make such oh. a good pick. Oh, nice okay, job, Just, I guess that's what they're going to have to huge. do right there. There's a nice QSS. That's huge. This is, they need no, to kill they, they need to kill for body blocking. He's animal, body dude. blocking. That is amazing. Oh, what? Please tell me you hit this. OK. All right. They got him. They got him. It's a huge shutdown they just got. The fact that Cass able to heal back so much, though, off of that is insane to me. What? Is he, is he it looked like she was just getting melted, and she just like lands one Q, E, 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 and just done, man. Like, she just came back so much health. That's nuts, dude. Alistair with good, Ooh, good damage. They can't kill Tarzan. They can't kill Tarzan. 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 Oh, the pike ult in the back. God, Barris. The that, was, that was super troll. I mean, you've got, you've got a Hex Shrinker on Tarzan. He has his ult. He still has his flash. There's yeah, no way you kill so him in that greedy, situation. Man. That was so greedy. Oh, no. He should be okay. He can get to his team here. This is... A little He's overzealous from Nar. Nar decides to run. We have Urgot coming. He's going for the chase. He says, hey, come over here. Then he says, never Oak mind. spawning in about five seconds, too. So that I think they're going to rotate over for that. Blue team should. I mean, they have good control of it. They have vision control of it. Why not? Yeah. And you're starting to see a massive CS differential coming out here from the jungle. Mm -hmm. 50 CS on the Graves versus Nocturne. Damn. Essentially, like, Nocturne's just going to be an ulti here. Yeah, the gold difference is like 2K. It's like insane. It's a close game. It. We're pretty even at, at this point, I think. And I, I absolutely hate the Nocturne build. When you go Duskblade in a game like this where you're so far behind, what's the point? Literally, just, just go off. Well, you have to one-shot somebody, right? It's like, but the thing is, like, Lucian, when Lucian has Bork, Cleaver, it's like he can survive in Tab Eyes. He's going to survive. He's not going to get one-shot ever. Cleaver, like. dude. The game's not about you. It's about the Cassiopeia. Do things to help your Cassiopeia win this game for, for you. For sure. For sure. Yep. This Cass is going to be the one that carries this game. Looking to defend Dude, this, this is game three. This is game fucking three too, man. This is for all the goddamn marbles, boys. Fuck. Goddamn. This is huge. It can. I mean, they're giving up pretty good vision blue. control right now, or like right around mid lane. I mean, what are they gonna try? And, think they're gonna try and siege this shit down? And they're grouping up around it. They want it. Yeah, it's tough, man. It's Cassie, if you get, if you get caught on this turret, it can can be rough for you. Yeah. Well, Nocturne just back too, so I mean, they're they're safe. Looks like Lucian's just afraid to hit the turret. But where's Cast Boots though? I've I've seen builds where Cast doesn't get boots. Oh yeah. <laughs> what, what what boots would you normally get on our train? Uh, it depends. Do I want, you know, s spell? Do, 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 do I why, want why spell? Why you gotta troll him? Why you gotta not... do this, Boston? Do, do, do I want spell uh, penetration? Then I go with the Sorks. Uh, do I want Same, mana? You know, uh, you know what? I completely agree, I, go with I completely agree. I completely agree. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, it's it's what it is. Or the, yeah. I feel that. It just it depends what I want, you know? Uh, if, I, if I build the Morello, Morello, then I go Sork. Mm. If I want early game aggression, I build Sork. It's just what it is. Yes, sir. I agree. I agree. I, I completely agree. I agree that you agree. Did Graves just? Oh wait. Did Graves just go walk over and take that? Oh no, he didn't. Okay, my bad. My bad. My bad. Visual bug. We're good. What Nocturne's gonna grow? I mean, he's heading top side right now. He's got Dust Blade finished. I mean, I guess like I'm trying to figure out who who Nocturne is gonna make a pick out of here. Oh, he's not. He's not. That's the point. He's literally just going to press R and just chill in the back line and hope that the vision does everything for him. <laughs> like, that's rough. Well, what would you do here in this situation? Would you rather go Cleaver or something just like CDR yeah, basically Cleaver. get a little tankier? Cleaver, get get tankier, get CDR. Yeah. Like, you're the game, you, you can't kill any right one, right? You can't kill the Lucian even. You can't kill the Urgot. There's no way you're killing Lissandra. There's no way you're killing Graves. Oh, and they're it's, starting this Baron. They're going to no get it for free. Where is the contest? Where is the contest? Close, man. This no, is a huge objective play right here. What are they doing? Is that a free Baron? 
Oh my god. Oh, looks god. like they're gonna fight oh, at that's least. A huge engagement. Orgot's in the back line. He's trying to set an arc. Get the ult up on him solo. Let's not get the ult. Three man this is good for This is good for Blue Team. Oh my god. They got this. Blue Nice job. Alistair getting flashed on double for list. Not enough. Oh, Lissandra with a one, two, three, minus one plus two kills. One, one for four. So they got, so they lost Baron, but they took down four people. Nocturne's the only one still up with it. They get mid tower, they're gonna get a second tower for this. Gold lead's still going for blue team though. It's so much more worth for blue team. But it's as so the red team, why fight? You got the Baron, that, just get out. out. Just leave, exactly. They, they flash into the enemy in team. Here. Yeah, they're gonna lose the inhib trade at least. They, they definitely lose the inhib here. There's no way they can defend this. That, mm, he just hate to see that. Honestly, Blue team is doing exactly what I predicted in, pre in the pregame. They need to take objectives fast, capitalize on this lead, and not let red team come back with any wiggle room. This is amazing play by Tarzan. And this is the NA greed that we were talking about earlier in the mm -hmm. cast, man. You get the Baron, but you want everything. You go for the fight, you flash in instantly through the through the game, dude. That's a three turret inhibitor and four death loss off that one That's decision. A huge fucking turn there. God. Huge turn. We have Nocturne here with the all seeing eye. Yeah, and this Baron is going to be useless, man. They can't really do anything with it. They just have to... Nope. This is a farm Baron now. It's funny because Cash is, like, so strong right now, too. If she just, like... If she got, like, just got off one really good fucking fight, you know what I mean? I feel like she could shred blue team. It's just the problem is I just don't see them getting it. Like, she's she's really strong right now, but... I mean, it's basically 5v4 with Nocturne on the team. Oh, oh Alistar no. gets pulled wow, in. That's a huge hook. I'm the wrong stunned? character, but no. good. You don't want to hook... Al Alistair there. At that point, you're just really saying, hey. But in that situation, it's fine. You get the free Alistair ult, can back off, do the same thing again. Now, if you hit a hook on him, he'll actually just die. So, yep. I agree. Graves is a big item. He's back. Gets the maw completed. Dragon's coming up in 10 seconds. The, you know, it's funny. For, for red team being behind, they're the ones making the rotations right now in the jungle. They're grouped up. They're looking... They look confident for being behind like 4k gold. Yes. They're just trying to use this this last Baron. Yep. They're trying they to get something, something from this. But oh, they can engage this. Spike. Oh, this could be bad. Huge, huge thing. As you can see, even being behind, being confident. Confidence is all perception. 4k difference. This is Will they check the ward? Will they check for the pink ward? No, the pink ward survives again. Dude, that thing has lasted in six years, man. Oh. It's a new one. It actually died for a little bit. They replaced it, but now... Okay, they finally got it. Oh my god, Lucia just hard into it. Lucia just hard into it. Yeah, Paris is going from Nocturne, but actually gets a pick off this. Are you Ooh. shitting me? He's, he actually just ran it and down. Now Cash is just running train in the back line. Listen to Ultra Cell. He's trying to honor himself in the back. Nocturne's walking up from Graves. Graves getting burned out pretty low. Graves got him. Good damage back from Graves. Graves though. cleans out the Nocturne. Wow, Graves really put Nocturne in the grave. You oh, know what I'm saying? Oh, oh, oh. The pipe picked off the pipe picked off Pike. the and the north. Oh, oh, no. It looks so good, man. It looks and blue so team good. has to rotate bot here. They need to rotate bot and pick off this last turret here. What are they doing? They're going back in for this shit, man. Alistair. Okay. They get the fight. He's running in the Cassiopeia. Can't Graves Tarzan do it? Kills. He wants the cast the kill. Oh, oh my goodness, the Graves gets the shutdown. It's reversed, actually. I take they that back, but it's they fight. They can't. All they can do is get Dragon, though, right? I mean, there's not. I mean, they're going to be yeah, embarrassed. Uh, probably probably embarrassed. take the enemy you blue. You definitely got to take this blue. This is huge. You don't want to see that on the Cassiopeia. This is huge. Cass just got more gold from that fight, too, actually. She, she, you know, Cass has got 2k to spend now. So it's like, yeah, they lost a the fight. But like, do you think in hyper late game that Cass is going to be able to carry these team fights or no? It depends. I mean, if the Lucian just loses his mind and runs it down again, maybe. Anything's possible when you have an AD carry like this, man. Jesus Christ. I actually feel bad for this guy. I hope you know that. <laughs> you feel bad for him? I feel you should feel bad, bad for us. Him. We have to watch this. You're taking a shit on this guy's chest, man. Jesus we, Christ. He should feel bad for, for us, dude. We are the ones that have to witness this. <laughs> He's the one that gets to make the choices here. You ain't wrong. You ain't wrong. 23 to 14, man. 5K. It, it, after all that nonsense that happened to only a 1,000 difference in gold since then. Like, it's crazy. That yep. is huge. Question is, what is the play from blue team? Are they just waiting for the next Baron? I assume that that is what they're going to do. They Wait. have a mountain now. What's Pike doing over there? 
Did you say 1k difference? Because I see a 5k difference. No, 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 no. It was a one. It was a one k. It was just four k for a long time after oh, all the fighting. Yes, it was, yes, it was just I agree. A one, it was only a one k after. Yeah, it's only it's only five now. That's what's oh, They're going on to the the Urgot Ooh, here. Urgot. Can he one v two? Stopwatch comes out. Up. He's tanky though. Feared. Against Nocturne these two, it. he can actually win this. He can is win this one v two. Gonna walk this out right now. No, he's not. No. Yeah, he's got the shield. Nice flash. If Fear comes out, though, he yeah, wants his cooldowns. He's silenced. Nice job. That was a good pick. Nocturne Ode actually pick. still has some use in the game. That's good. That's a great pick. That's a great pick. I completely concur. And the big thing about that pick is Baron is up in 23 seconds, so they can probably get vision control around Baron and maybe force something with the Urgot being dead. The problem I have with this is Urgot being yeah, out of position like that is it, that's not okay. These are mistakes that you see a lot in the NA communities. They need to be together. They need to push us five, go top, get another tower down, force a mistake from red team. Push, make them nervous. Don't give them room. Look at red team controlling the map as if as if they're King Kong. This is just terrible from blue team right now. And they just need to stall. Blue team just needs to stall. You have 13 seconds on your Urgot. He does have teleport, so he can join. Just don't run it down before he respawns. That's all yep. you got to do. Oh, Cass got Rylai's now too. Oh, that's gonna be such a pain in the ass. Min hips back up. Baron's pinked. Fuck. You do oh, have a mountain. God, this it is gonna be. This is gonna be like one team fight is gonna determine where this goes, man. Fuck. Yes. Yes, it is. It's hey, what better way? way with, what better way would you have it? I know, all right. I just don't want and they're to starting it while the vision is still there. They're, they're baiting crazy. the enemy team to they come better here. Pull, they have to. They have to pull up and focus. Then, Nar with the lead. He's got Meganar coming up. Watch out for that big dick Goldie. Oh, the the four that man. Is w huge. Is like, no, no, ult again. Oh, blue team, you are fucked. Alistair tanking up so much. Ulti to land up. They got the damage on the uh, the Urgot. Cash is running everybody down. Rylai's too much. Graves can't do shit about it. Night taken. Good night, bitch. He lives. He's alive. It doesn't matter. They're, they're cutting they're, him they're, off. They the is cutting him off. Oh, yeah, we're fucked. Yeah, that's... He just hates... Mm. The Lissandra just needs to press R, oh, man. Second God, time he goes with the five so people. Good, she had like a he has R. Like a four-man W, man. That was so good. He has R. He has Zanyas, and he just lost his team the game. Not like this. Are you shit? Wait, he has R up still? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's he didn't rough. hit R. He didn't hit R. He didn't hit Zionist. He hit nothing. I'll tell you what he hit. He hit the throw button. I don't know what he is thinking. This is outrageous. This is disgusting. Like, they're this not going to go for it. Legends. It's just, this is I oh, not legends. It looks so. I just thought it was going to be so good when Liz flanked, man. Then she just flopped it. I just like, I can't believe it. It looks so good, man. And then just feel the. I mean. That, that late game cast damage, like, that's what you were saying earlier, too, is that she's just getting so big late game, man. Like. And, and I think this just, shows, this just shows the level of competition and how much better this tournament is than the NA Scouting Grounds. This was the champion. So Ligo was the champion of the Scouting Grounds. He won it all with that team. But first round of TCS, looks like he doesn't have what it takes to play in this game. Oof. What a, what a fast recall time. Actually amazing. <laughs> this is it. Mm. It's almost a dead even gold game now. And what this comes Anybody down to, can, can Cassio press R? Or can, can Lissandra press R? Yeah. What's gonna happen? <laughs> isn't, that what, isn't that what happened last game too? All it basically was like, they just need to use their fucking ultis. That's what it turned out last game. They just had to use ults more and they're still fucking that up, man. It's crazy. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's, it's a hard thing to do. Like, it is. I'm it telling is. you, man, when, you, when you're... Hard. When you're on the stage and the bright lights are in your eyes, it's hard to find that R button sometimes. That R button, dude. man. At this point, I'm, I'm convinced he doesn't even have an R button on his keyboard. <laughs> nice free ocean dragon for red side. Like I said, nah, I don't think it's going to do too much. You know, I don't think it's going to do too, too much at this point in the game, but hey. Yeah. Okay. They still have Baron, man. They have Baron for another two, three minutes. No, they got Nar top. He's got TP up. They have Baron. Yeah, and they, they do have Baron splitting on both waves. Mid inhibitors down. Blue team needs to figure out how they want to deal with this. Do they just force a fight? Do they yeah. let another inhib drop? What is the call here? I like the Grave scoop up executioners, too. Try and get rid of some of that Cassidy B healing. 
Yeah, the very healing too with Borg. Yeah. This is a great push. This is what this, blue team should have yeah. done when they're in the lead, so but instead good, man. they decided not to. Gold leads for getting bigger and bigger, dude. They need a crazy pick here. They can't stop the siege though. They can't. We have yeah, this is three. This is three siege right? minions. There's nothing they can do against this, man. There's no way to stop this. The front lines are so three big. Three cannons. Three cannons. Bot and him going down, man. Nars still shoving up top. They got list. They got list pinned up there. There's nothing they can fucking do. They gotta at least protect the top one. If they give the top and hit, it's over. It's going down, man. They're wow. Nars beating it. List can't stop Nar. Wow. They are just throw up this these shit out. Nocturne forcing the fight on Graves. Gets oh the no! Graves is the game. Will Lissandra press R? He pressed R! They have a chance! He pressed R! I think he's reached up, but they got no Oh shit, he goes in! Ferris dead! Oh my god! I fucking held it. I don't- I, I have no oh. idea how- I, Yeah, it's amazing what that one button does. Their fucking mind was gonna win the goddamn game? Holy shit! They actually hold it down. I guess you were right. Liz just had to click fucking ult. That's it. Yep, that, that is, is what it comes down to. She still that got Zanya's up. She got Flash. They didn't. They just had a fucking Gligar. That's all I needed. Ca once you once you erase Cassiopeia, the game is won. Lucian had great left to right movement. It was as if I was watching the NBA scouting grounds. And then on top of that, we have Graves. He goes in perfectly. He slides in Michael Jackson moonwalk style in the front, and he gets the kill he needs. This is what we need to see from Tarzan. This is what we need to see from Lucian. You need to play confident if you want to win this game. At this level, it's not wanting it enough. Agreed. Thank you. Agreed, man. And now the question is, can they deal with these super minions? You have all three inhibitors Ooh, down, two super... Inhibs, yeah, man. yeah, super super minions spawning, double super minions in every single lane. How do you deal with this? How do you hold this? And it looks like Nocturne's looking by. I don't I don't think they can. That's the problem. If Red Team is playing it safe, play it right, and they're patient, they should be able to just shove this. They should be able to push it in, man. I remember, you gotta remember last fight, they lost too. Red Team lost that because Varus, like, front line, basically. You know what I mean? Yes. Like he, he, I mean, he went so close. I mean, they, I mean, they had three, three guys on him, like so fucking quick. Yes. <clears throat> they they do have decent wave clear though. They have, they, they have the Lissandra. They have the Graves. They're just gonna need to fight again. They want to end the game right now. They know if this goes any longer, blue team's gonna win the game. They need to finish now. There's nothing they can do, man. The minions are pushing in. This is game They've three fight. on the line, guys. This is it. They've got to fight. Right, just boys in. They're looking for it. They need something. Will Lissandra press R? Will he press R? He presses R! Graves? He presses R! Graves oh, still doing so damage? Lines. They're knocked their ult down a pipe. Oh, where's the damage? Oh, they oh, have no damage. Coming out. They're staying alive! They just can't. The Jordan minions! They can't the flash in from Tarzan! Gee, fucking. Oh no. Fucking oh, this is the game. No, I'm just hitting the tower. At this point, it's a triple kill. Tarzan oh, goes oh, down. God, dude. Oh my what god. What a fucking finish, man. What a great game by these two beautiful teams, guys. Let's get a round of